Hey you guys, what is up? Welcome back, Satisfactory, Meaty Factory. That's what I'm gonna call this Meaty Factory. I like gold LLC. So if you guys missed last episode, you're gonna wanna see it because I zigzagged down that big mountain. Uh, I found out I need now this um, copper sheet stuff. So I made one of the constructors back here do wire, the other one do copper sheet. And it wasn't running. Because whilst I was gone, this thing filled up with wire, which is really good. So I moved some over there, gave me some room for the sheet. So we're going to run this copper sheet in. And then I double checked this one. I had a, I, this one's fine actually. Uh, probably should take a sheet of that. That one's okay. This one's full. This one, I had to take some of the piping out of here, or some of the rods. I just put them in the ones over there. Uh, for now, I want to keep this stuff running. So I, been gone a, I've been gone a little while. I don't know, not that long, I guess. But I do want these things to go until they max out. And hopefully by then, I will be up and running on the factory floor over there with a lot of this clean this area up these ones here this one's going to burn out because i didn't actually it's looks like it's offline yeah it just went offline i think this one just went offline this one here yep it's offline all right we're good there and that one that one's going to go offline okay so where we left off, we have coal coming down the mountain. And it should be, yeah, this, oh, it's been offline for a while. Well, that's unfortunate. So we have coal coming down from up there where those trees are, zigzagging down and coming into here. Oh, it's doing pretty good. We're going to run that belt down here, eventually. And then I made a little side area over here thinking that it's my first, it's my first uh, time trying this one. I don't remember doing this before, but if it was in the game, I probably did. So I have it. The to-do list is a coal generator, one pipeline pump, and at least some pipeline i'm gonna need more copper sheet but for now we should be able to uh, do this all right so that looks like the inlets is there nothing on the other side so this is going to be the water inlet i might want to do this the other way i mean i've already run that other belt a million miles what's what's another mile right So this is going to be water, and this is going to be fuel, water. All right, so now we got to figure out how to do this piping. So I think we start with a pipeline pump. This is supposed to be able to lift up like 20, 20 meters or something. Um, that angle isn't very good. Kind of ugly. Weird, the angle of that, isn't it? Oh, it comes out the end there. I thought it came out of those thingies. Hmm. Build mode noodle. Oh, I see. I can noodle it up to here. There we go. Okay, that makes more sense. So that's got to be powered down there. How many watts does that take? 
for mm, I might I might have some available over here in this line I guess we'll find out because I'll trip the breaker ASAP it's not running yet so it could still trip This is only going to... See, I'm going to need probably two of these here. I don't think I... I didn't bring enough to make two, did I? Uh, power... Oh, I did. Problem is... They're not going to fit side... Oh, no. I need more. It's still going to block... Actually... I might be able to work with it. No... Maybe. No. I don't know. <laughs> I need more, uh... I need more cable. What the deuce? Hey, get out of here! I don't know what that fat, tiny-headed dude is doing here. Jerk. Alright. Let's just knock out some cable here real quick. I, use, I burned through my cable, um... Running those power lines all the way down from there, too. I do is there a different so I have power pole mark one wonder if is there another power pole coming up anytime soon it doesn't look like it so we'll probably just stick with those power pole level ones Hey up! I need to make a. You know what I need to do right now? I can make a ramp. Oh, jeez. Whoop! There we go. Ramp. That thing looks cool. Look at that big turbine in there. All right. So. I got that thing pretty much at the edge. This is gonna let me uh let me clip it a little bit. That's not bad. Yeah, these things joined. That's cool. They joined half and half. So pipe wise. We have a cross. Can we attach any pipe? Split it four ways. So we have to get rid of this. Make a cross on here. Doesn't go on there. Oh, there we go. Okay. There. Can't afford. Oh, I need more. Uh, Hmm. That's going to block that inlet. I need more um, sheeting. More sheeting, please. Bum, ba, da, ba. Hoot, hoot. So I've been running some sheeting in here while we were doing this. You can see. There we go. That's enough. Mm hmm. I might wait to put that piece on, though. I'm going to bring the uh, conveyor down here. I'm going to need to split the conveyor, and I'm going to have two belts coming in. You know what? I thought I saw a pipeline support. What if I put that there and raise it up to there? That might allow me to get... I don't know if I'll be able to sneak a conveyor through there or not. So we'll figure it out. Might be able to sneak a conveyor through there. Like from here. 
Put the splitter out here. All right, let's bring the let's bring the coal down. I'm almost thinking I should run. Foundations like that. Okay, we gotta get up here. Somewhere up here is the coal. I might run it just around the back of this. Reach it? Oh, it will. Immersion. Bring it down. Okay. You think about right there. And down this way to about there. All right, now I need a splitter. We want to come in that side and come out this side. There, out this side. I'm gonna there. How's that look? Oh, well, that's not terrible. I could have come down a little bit farther with this one to here, but that's that's all right, I think. Hey, it's my first coal thingy. All right, the coal should be coming down here. Yep, there it is. A little bit slow. I think, um, well, I don't know. It, it Was this thing explode? Can it explode? <laughs> Can it explode if you don't have, like if the coal runs out or the water runs out? It said something about one or the other. Anyway, there's the, I guess these are the power lines here. We're going to want to join these up. And then what I'll do is I'll run power lines down through here. And I'll run power lines down through there. And then we can also run some down here. We'll see. This should give us, uh, if, I com if I merge these two together, it should give us 150. Current amount of building, water, consumption, 45 meters cubed per minute. I hope that, I hope that pump can keep up with two of these. I don't, maybe I should have run another pump down there. You know, like right now I've got one pump. I could have put another pump down there. We'll see. Hopefully nothing explodes. I need this stuff to get in here first, I think. All right, here comes the coal. Here comes the coal. So it's going to use 15 coal per minute. I'll have to keep an eye out to see if, uh, if it can keep up. If it starts taking that away... I don't want it to explode. I want this to get all the way up. I guess I can start laying down uh, the thingies. I said I was going to go over here. Wait. I was going to go over here first. 
down this road. Hoot! Hoo-yo! Hoo-yo! Hoo! This power consumption could add up pretty quick. I'll just go ahead and jump all the way off the thing, why don't you? Alright, so power pull as numero uno. We want to put him at. This is just in case, you know, you use up those four connections pretty quick, so it doesn't hurt to make extra poles. All right. That's good for there. Put another one here. Put another one here. I want one here, one here. There, there, there. Oh, ah, dang it. <laughs> Now, my other place is those powered, and then these schmeltas. Where did I put those things? I don't want to put it right there. Wish me luck. That didn't work. It's that thingy. That thingy. I need these two connected. I'm going to use enough here. Oh, the cable. Like a electrician. All right. We want to go from this one. It's not going to tell me if there's power there yet, right? I wish I could jump up on that thingy. Alright, now this one. That one. It's funny, I laid all these poles and there's only one connection from each one left over. Because of all my, all my connection thingies. Better do it this way. You have one at each area, though. I could stretch them down that way if I need to or wherever. Plus, it looks better. Let's see how much current we're going to be pulling. I'm just throwing stuff on here, and I don't even know if... Did the end one there? I probably shouldn't have done that end one. Do this one here. This one here. Gonna have another one in here. I'll probably have to move this this thingy. All right. Well, I don't have anything here yet. Let's just see. If these things aren't going because they're not drawing power.
All right, so right now, no consumption, but the max connections are at 44. And these are 75 each, and I have them joined together. So we should be fine. Show me the connect. Oops, no, 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 don't do that. Same thing. All right, so we should be good with this. Now, I got to configure, get one of these going, probably, can I get over this? Phew! This first one here, I will be bringing iron into this. And what I'm doing with that iron is, we're going to smelt it here, or no, oh, you know what? There's a smelter up there already. Hmm. Well, I'm going to be... I don't know. I just don't know. I don't need this smelter here. All right, so maybe I'll go over here with this one. And we start with storage. All right, on this one. That's right. That looks right. Okay, storage. And then we're going to come out of this storage without a smelter. We'll just leave that one up there. Or should I leave that one up there? Because we want this all to look the same. Hmm. I'm going to put one here. Forget how close I did this. It's pretty close. That looks right. Now we gotta put a splitter. Splitter. through there. 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 And then let's go ahead and set this thing to do we'll do plates and then we'll do rods and then we'll do rods on this one. Because we have to do it to the rods first. And then we can make it uh, go into um, screws. Now what I need to do is reroute this belt down here. I'm going to get rid of this guy. This guy. I will let those things run out. All right. see where approximately I need to go with this is go around that other side of that rock I mean I could change the miners but it doesn't I don't think it really matters at this point what oh two I don't have enough I need plates I need plates! Actually, I don't have any of these things here making plates. But I have plates for days over here. These two parrots have been chilling here, but they don't want to be French. They don't want friendship time. I don't know why. Might need to convert this back. I don't think I need as much. Um, I don't need as much of that piping uh, copper sheet as I thought. I'll let it run for a bit. It might be a component of something else. How are we doing on screws? Doing pretty good. Okay. 
thinking about bringing it to here, make it look better. And then in. Okay. Well, let's see if our power works. If it does, this should start smelting. If I actually connect it to it. That one's connected over there. All right, here we go. First test of our new first floor of our factory with coal power. It's not doing anything. Maybe that's why. Still not doing anything. Those things... No power. Idle. What am I doing wrong? It's showing the connections. Water. Current amount in building. Zero. Alright, so I screwed up the water pump thingy. <laughs> I was messing around. I put the, the lift pump... Uh, you guys saw it. Anyway, so I'm back in here to try and do it correctly. Let's see, I've got... Alright, so... I was working with all the logistics stuff, but I forgot. You gotta actually get a water extractor going. So that would be helpful. Building a water extractor. Now, I think this thing gives us... Maybe 10 meters a lift, something like that. So maybe we can put on these guys. Does that connect to that thingy? Oh, well, maybe, maybe that won't connect to there. What? Get on the wall, man. Kind of wanted it up higher. Like that. That looks connected. This. To there. This to there. I hear I hear noise. So if you can see what this thing is doing. Okay, so this flow rate is inconsistent. Maybe because there's air in the line? That thing's working. I think. Head lift 10 meters. It's only doing 150 flow rate, and it's capable of doing 300. Think it maybe there was air in the line or something? Huh.
Everything looks like it's working down here. That thing's cool. How big is that thing? Holy cow. All right. Let's go see if it's generating any power. Or if the thing... I don't see any smoke. Oh, but the coal's moving. Wait, those things are green now. Those It's actually working. Oh, there's the smoke. All right, so consumption is only five. Oh, 12. Max consumption is going to be this. But look at this. Current amount of water in building. It is borderline on the water. I might need a second pump or something. 45 cubic meters per minute. Well, we'll let it run for a bit, see if it's going. All right, so where did we, what did we end up doing over here? Oh, look at this. I've got this in the way of my storage container. Didn't think about that, did you? All right, I might be able to, this is doing rods and plates and this is doing what rods so we probably want to go maybe I'll bring this here here Oh, that's not going to work. Bring this to here. And then I'll see if I can set up. Hmm. If I set up. I think, oh, I needed to get a. I'm trying to remember. Put this here. Bring these rods in. We can be continue making our screws right and then put another storage thing here storage please hey where did what the all right so that once we get that thing powered, I think what I'll do is I'll grab probably power from over here. There we go. Now we should be making screws here. All right, so screws, plates, and rods. And what that did was that replaced this, this whole thing here. In between me figuring out that I screwed up the water thing, because I took the uh, the iron supply from all the stuff I had here, which was the things that was making all these screws, and then I had two things making rods. Uh, I went ahead, disassembled it all, and just stacked up some storage until I'm ready for that. And then I got to figure out exactly what I'm going to do here. But the good thing is we got this going. I think what we're going to need, what I'm going to need is... See, I'm thinking you should be able to power this by this. Like, if you quickly change it over. <laughs> but I think I might need another water thingy. Because that is just not supplying enough water. Oh, now it is. Uh, it just took a little while for it to kind of get caught up. That's what it was. All right. So here is our current consumption. 
here's our max consumption of everything we have hooked up and then here is our capacity so that's good that's looking good obviously if we need to make more but right now we got two of them burning away like I said this part here this one and this one and that one replace what I had going over there and all of these see so I have what do I have two this is uh, three this is one one two three that's one set one two three that's two sets so this stuff here what I'm gonna do is use the two irons that are over there and run them in here then I'll do a I'll move up to the second floor and then I'll do the copper and the concrete now out here I was trying to figure out how to put that lift pump vertically so I had to put like uh, walls on or things on the wall to attach it to so this is pretty cool like this see you could put this wall on but what about the, the other walls four meter wall see what it looks like oh yeah and then I have the ability to paint this stuff too I have this brush so what is this default stuff custom give your factory a cons consensual it's cons <laughs> consequential <laughs> you can make this stuff out of flower petal ooh that would be good for somebody I know I wish it had this blue and this orange I guess that's what you would do with the custom one Oh, it could be, or is that black? Blue. Quick switch. Oh, you can see all the colors. Oh, there's like a teal. Oh, yeah. Well, that's cool. So we can do walls. Once we get our foundation going up. I got to figure out how to do that. I, I don't know if... Oh, well, maybe we'll try that right now. So if I had a wall... And a wall... And a wall... Right? And then... A one meter foundation... At the top... thinking that's how I make the next floor I'll have to do it oh figure out what the tallest thing is it looks like this is that might not be tall enough probably go three high give ourselves some room in here and make the uh, second floor going up but that's pretty cool and we can paint it later you don't have to paint it right now who you but that'll give it that polished look of brilliance. So everything's working. I, I screwed up because I was so focused on on just the logistics stuff. Like, I thought this is all I had. I forgot that there's a water extractor, obviously. Big old pontoons. That's how you suck it out of the water. I actually cut out about 20 minutes of me reorganizing and trying different things. And I'm like, oh my god, I'm an idiot. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> Looking pretty good so far. It's a good solid start. And already, just on this bottom floor, I cleared out a whole bunch of mess here. This next thing, what I might do before I route this one, I might build the next floor, right? And get those going, which is all the stuff coming from over there, basically. The copper's there, and the both limestones are over there. Get them going up there, and then I'll bring these in on the bottom. And at that point... What I'm, what I'm thinking about doing is my hub and all this other stuff, I might want to build something right here, like off the side in this area, and set it all up here. We'll see. 
it's pretty cool. What I'm doing is I'm building all this stuff and, and just to make sure that I'm always gathering resources because the levels are getting higher and higher and a lot more stuff for me to, to have to make. I mean, this stuff that I have just like stored in here, this will be gone in no time. All this, this will be gone in no time. And these things, probably. I, re I did, um, this had stopped working at some point here. And I had to put in a second one. You can see it's going pretty good. I've already had a double up on the on the wire. And it's pretty good. That one's full. And then this one is plates. Got one more row of plates. And that one's full. This one's get it's gonna be full any second. You know what I should do is I will take Oh, let's just take whatever we can. And I'll put it over here. That way that thing can keep working as long as the bios. But hopefully before too long I'll have um, I'll have this stuff routed back over here. So just move this stuff in here. Usually keep a couple hundred on me. Keep 400 on me. There we go. Oh, perfect amount. Ha! It's like you planned it. All right, you guys, that's going to do it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'm liking it so far. See you guys next episode.